We have a catch, guys. I can tell by the ring and I can see fur. What do we have? Hey, good morning, guys. It is the 16th of January. About 16 degrees, but the sun's out, so it feels really good. And I'm just making it out to the property for a check. Don't really know what to think as far as, you know, traps working and all that stuff. But if they do work, what I am seeing so far is a lot of movement. I see a lot of small game tracks. And back where I caught the bobcat and the red fox last year, there was a set of canine tracks. So encouraged by the fresh sign as I'm walking in. That sun is bright, man. Um, so encouraged by the fresh sign coming in. We'll go check some traps, guys. I said a lot of fresh, what appear to be canine tracks. Someone who's better at this, please jump in. There are domestics around here, so I gotta be careful in making assumptions. So if anyone has any recommendations for identifying this, that would be cool. Straight up dog tracks on my tracks from yesterday. I'm really hoping there's a catch down here, or at least some fresh signs where they checked out my sets. But yeah, you can see the some sort of canine cable right down here, right along my tracks. So, well. Oh, wow, look at that. I can see his trail right there. That's cool. Might have missed him. We'll keep looking. Doesn't look like anything's happening down here, guys. Well, I say that. Daggum. Oh man, that's close, dude. Hang on, let me put my stuff down real quick. See if I can find a good track here. That looks to me like a coyote. Big track. Oh yeah, right there. Interested. Came to the back side, started digging, hit the log. We got nothing in that dog proof. Nothing in this one that was getting investigated a few days ago. I was hopeful on this one, guys. Nothing there, though. And I don't see anything bouncing up here on that fallen tree. But I've been fooled by a bobcat before, so we'll just ease up there and have a look. Oh, we had something right on top of it yesterday. Look at that. Super fresh tracks. Got right up to it and then walked off. Interesting. Oh, I like that. Trending the right way, guys. All right, well, I'm going to get out of here, guys. Put that in the background. That's pretty, huh? But a uh, lot of movement. Tracks everywhere. Wild. Most of the sets had tracks within a couple feet. So, yeah, they were moving last night. That's awesome. They were getting closer every time. So, you know, maybe tomorrow, maybe the next day we'll have a catch, guys. Y'all have a great day. All right, guys. 20th of January. Still grinding. Checking traps today. It's cold still. Probably about 9 degrees, 10 degrees. And uh, I don't think it's gotten outside of 20, 30 degrees for the last week and a half. So all the snow's still here. Anyway, back to it. We'll check these traps, see if we've got anything. I'll get you turned around. I don't know what happened over here, but the dog proof is knocked over. So let's go check it out. Oh, there's little tracks all around it. Oh yeah, something came in and checked it out. Let's see if there's any bait in there. A little bit. It's probably just frozen. So, all right, let me get my hand back warmed up. All right, now we're ready. Let's see here. We got anything over here? Nope. 
in the net there. I'm gonna go up to the brush pile. See if we get anything. We have a catch, guys. I can tell by the ring and I can see fur. What do we have? Looks like another cat. Nope. What do we got? We got a coyote. Alright. Yeah, coyote number two. No freaking kidding. Wow. Nice looking fur. Good deal. Let's see. We got a good catch. Nice deep pad catch. Looks like another female by how she's acting, so. Heck yeah, guys. Persistence pays off. Got us coyote number two. All right, so we'll get this uh, this coyote taken care of. Doesn't look too big, but it's a target species. Good looking fur, we'll get her taken care of, guys. Heck yeah. And it just goes to show how much patience can pay off. And even in these freezing, freezing temps. Might have made sense to pull the traps, but According to me, <laughs> made sense to leave them out. Had some cold mornings, some dangerous roads, but we got another coyote off the property, so that's a win right there. That one's taken care of. We'll go check the rest of these sets out here, and then we'll get that one remade, and we'll get out of here. So that MB550 wasn't frozen. I can't remember if I cleaned this one up or when I did. I'll have to go in and check the uh, the videos that I've taken. It's just been so dang cold. So yeah, MB550 still doing well in this cold weather. We'll get this uh, get this coyote out of the trap. Nice looking fur. Frozen tail. Jeez. Yeah, nice looking fur. I don't see anything rubbed or anything like that. Big old tick on her ear. That's gross. But uh, we'll get the set remade and I'll show you the remake. All right, there's the remake. Everything's frozen, but have the trap bedded right here. Dirt hole with a little bit of bait in the backside with the sheep tool. And then a little bit of lure, fox gland lure on the top there. So kind of a mess, but that's okay. A lot of scent from that, uh, from that female coyote that was caught so that's it time to get back to the car warm up get this coyote taken care of skinned out so that's a good check i'll have to look back when the last catch was made on the farm but it's been a while uh and it's been cold but uh anyway it's been good so thanks for watching guys we'll see you in the next one